All right, so I just got back, y'all, from getting my um fruit. As y'all saw the video I made earlier dealing with the kumquats and the... I almost forgot the name of these already. The goosenberries. Oh, yeah, my little berries. Remember, these are the Grustin berries, and these are the kumquats. So later, she was she told us to just come to the house and, you know, get the um the kumquat, the kumquat fruit for the most part. Yes? Of what? Okay, we'll find something. So yeah, so yeah, so we're just gonna stay up here and enjoy. I'm doing pretty much fruit for the whole week for the most part. So I got a lot of um kumquats, um these leaves, man. So I was doing like a little bit of research, you know, just, you know, just the um you know the articles and going through that, my lit my um lecture for the most part. We try to eat all the food. Look at me. No, I don't want that. I gotta, okay, I guess I eat one, son. Mm. So, yeah, yeah. so, these are really good and hydrating for the most part. Yeah, they're still ripening. So, I'm probably gonna go back and buy it in three or four days. My bad, I'm eating some fruit. I see. Eat it. So, yeah, so, these are kumquats. You know, for the most part, what I looked at, but the kumquats, they just got a good concentration of, um, of, um, well, they really have antioxidants for the most part. These are great for the skin, you know. But they got a good, a good source of um copper and um iron for the most part. So I got the leaves because I don't want nothing to go to waste. Yeah, as I said, how pretty these leaves look for the most part. So I'm gonna, I'm gonna tear up all these fruits for the most part. I'm gonna tear them all up and and then I'm gonna um also make me some teas with my um um lagoustin berries for the most part. Remember I talked about lagoustin berries? Um, so I found this 100 yard too for the most part. This one, these one, yeah, that's cool. I'm gonna knock this off. Yeah, so these are more than the goosen berries, and this is a good tea, right? This this is what I call, call my powerful brain food. This is my brain food. This right here is just a hydrating fruit for the most part. With a good with a good source of um copper. You know, copper is a, a powerful conductor of electricity for the most part. So we need to get the, we need the electrons to flow through and a good source of iron too. So these are gonna be good, y'all. I'm I'm excited. I can't wait to eat these. Um well, I can't wait. I already been eating what I'm talking about. These bad boys good. Yeah, I know. Mm. Have some kumquat trees going over, so we're eating the kumquat <gasps> at the same yeah, time. Not the, the fruit, the fruit seeds out for the most part. So we see them, y'all. You know. Then the like, gruesome, you know, we're gonna make good tea out there for the most part. And you know that's what we're gonna do. This right, this right. If you want to sleep good. This is what you need. So next year, these won't be back in season until like really next year. And I'll be having, I know where all the spots are to get these. So I might, um, I'll probably do a good job. I might try to sell these. And you want to dream? And this is good. Rippling, boy, can I talk? It's okay, it's okay. So these are good for like gastro, people like gastro issues. And these are really bitter. So this is what I like to call my tongue food. What I mean by tongue food and the bitterness is, it's going to do a good job of stimulating all those inactive parts of the tongue for the most part. So when you stimulate the tongue, the tongue is like the, the highway to the um, brain. And we, by stimulating the tongue, you got two nerves. You got the um, linguistic nerve and the facial nerve, which innervates the tongue for the most part. And that's going to have a direct effect on the pons part of the midbrain. And that's, why, and that's going to help affect the, um, by stimulating the, mid, the midbrain, you're going to also stimulate the hypothalamus. It's going to help you stimulate the... Um, you know, homeless for the most part. That's what we want right there. So that's why I like the bitter food, stuff like this, and specific type of um. Even I, I got some type of bitter nuts that I eat that you might not hear many people talk about for the most part. So I kind of like that too. So it's gonna be pretty good. And then these, I'm just gonna tear them up. I'm like, I'm gonna like rip. Well, actually, I already, the kids they, they eating them all up right now. I'm supposed to be doing my fruit, but they try they gonna eat all my fruit up too. I ain't gonna have nothing to eat. So look at they out there doing all that crazy yelling and stuff. Boy, stop about that yell if I give this two piece. <laughs> yeah, that's what I thought. You don't want these hands. You don't want that work. But yeah, so I'm out, y'all. I just wanted to just kind of make a quick video on these type of things. And I'm out. Y'all got any questions? Like I said, just ask. That's that dopamine. I mean, dopamine.